Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show how to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and in this video, I will show how to make intro animation for American football. So first one, select this background layer and lock. Then let's right mouse, go to new and camera. So, don't change any settings, click OK. Click OK. And select these all layers. Click toggle switch mode. And click this checkbox for 3D layer. OK, so select this layer eyebrow. Let's zoom in here. And let's select this eye. Let's link to head layer. Select head layer. And go to pen behind. Move the anchor point down. Clusation tool and press air. Let's see chain rotation like this Okay, and select is head layer link to body select body Go to a pen behind move the anchor point Like this clusation tool press air. Let's see Okay, that's good. So let's make some for this layer select is eyebrow and eye layer link to head select is head layer link to body and select the layer, go to pen behind, move the anchor point here, clusation tool, and press air, let's see, okay, so in this time, let's first select this camera and let's right mouse, go to camera and create orbit node, and for move the anchor point center, hold control, double click pen behind icon, clusation tool, and go to text, Let's write here American football. Okay, and clusation tool. Move to center like this. And click this icon for 3D. And let's go to change view to top. And select this text layer, press P and move the back. Okay, and let's select this right side and left side, press P and move to back. Change view active camera. Okay, select left side, press S and change scale. Let's move to like this and select this right side, press S change scale move right here okay and let's select this layer body press P and move to back and press S change scale and put here and select this left body press P move to back and press S, change scale and move to here so select this camera control and press P let's change view like this ok and let's go to here make new pass in keyframe and go to 3 seconds and move to back Okay, select keyframes, make easies, go to graph editor, select this graph, and let's make graph like this. Okay, back to keyframes, and let's select this text layer, go to first second, and let's open animation comes there 3. I will use text animation. Open starter preset and text layer, animate characters, select this overshot and click in. And let's move to right, let's see. Okay. And let's move to center this text layer. Okay, so in this time select this right side. And let's select this blue arrow, hold shift, move to back. Okay, let's 
move to front like this okay and change scale and move to right so select is left side let's press P and move to back let's move to back more okay and press s chain scale and move to here okay not bad close these settings and select this text layer in this time let's press s max sketch frame and go to here chain scale like this and Go to back, let's select two frames, make easy, go to graph editor, make graph like this, okay back to two frames and let's hold shape press P, make new pass in two frame and go to here, let's move to up and select pass in two frames, make easy. Okay, go to graph editor, select this graph, move right. Okay, I like it. So, in this time, let's select this text layer, Ctrl D, and press P. Let's close two frames, press S, close scale two frames, and move to down. Let's write here championships. And click session 2. Go to color. And let's use pink color. Click OK. Change font size. And move to down. And let's move right this layer. Okay, let's move right a little bit like this. Okay, that's good. So, go to FS Presses, search Effect Draw Shadow. Select this drop shadow used for this text. And change shadow color white. And change opacity 100%. And change distance. Okay, change direction. And change distance a little bit like this. Okay. Move right this text a little bit to right. Nice. Okay, so let's back to animation composer. Click browse. And let's add some shape elements. Open starter precoms and select shape elements. And select these lines. Let's click for close add sound. Click add. Okay, and move to left. Move right more. Okay, nice. So close these keyframe settings and select these hit layers. Let's add rotation keyframes. Press R, make Z rotation. Go to 10 keyframes, chain rotation like this. And go to here. Make new rotation, go to 10 keyframe, chain rotation for random hit animation, go to here, make new rotation, go 10 keyframes, change again, and make keyframes easy. Select work area. Okay. Select keyframes, copy and go to here, control V for paste and select these eyes 
press S, click this icon and make sketch uframe, go to 3 uframes for go to frame by frame, use page down in keyboard 1, to 3 chain scale 5 go to 3 uframes again, 1, to 3 change 100% and make uframes easy, easy let's see nice, let's copy uframes and go to here Control v for paste and here, here and here nice and select this body press air make rotation keyframe and go to here chain rotation 3 and move to right make two frames easy and here make new rotation go to some two frames change minus 3 and here make new rotation again go to next two frame change 0 and here make new rotation a new keyframe 5 and here let's add new keyframe change minus 3 and finally make new rotation go to here change 0 ok nice so in this time select this body and go to here Hold Shift, press P, and make new pass in Q frame, and go to middle, move to down, go to next U frame, say first U frame, copy pass. This is for bones animation. Let's see. Nice. This is more realistic. Say Q frames, copy and Control V here and here and here, here and last here. Let's see. Okay, this bones very nice tips for realistic animation okay so close by the two frames and hit and ice select this right character and first select this hit go to here and press air make rotation two frame go 10 two frames make two frame minus three now let's change quality quarter for now Okay, select this left character, press U for C keyframes and go to here, make new rotation, go 10 keyframes, chain 3 and go to here again, make new keyframe and here make 0, say keyframes, make easy, let's see. Okay, so go to here, make new rotation. Go to in frame change 6 and here change 0 and select body go to here let's press R make Z rotation go to here change 3 or change minus 3 and make two frames easy and go to here make new rotation change 2 so I will add random two frames for fast animation change this again minus 4 and here change 3 and here change 0 and here change again 3 so go to here let's select this body hold shift press P make new passing two frame Go to middle, move to down, and go to next two frame. Say first two frame, copy pass, and make two frames easy. And let's copy two frames and paste here, and here paste, and here, here and here. Okay, that's good, not bad. So let's close these two frames. And select these eyes, press S, click this icon, make scale 2 frame, go to 3 2 frame, change scale 5, go to 3 2 frames again, change 100%. Make 2 frames easy. And copy 2 frames and paste random eye blink animations. Ok, 
Okay, so close these keyframes and select this camera controller, press U and go to here, let's select 8 seconds, press N, change first seconds like this and right mouse select work area like this, okay so go to last keyframe camera orbit and change camera position like this let's see okay select these all keyframes right mouse keyframe interpolation change auto bezier to linear click ok okay not bad i like it so guys thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck